welcome back to a very special place, Downland's Estate. We've been here before, but today something is a bit different. We're going to be shooting a simulated game day. I'm seriously excited about today. Oh! Sober in oh. six and a half, baby. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> There's going to be four drives, a hybrid competition, and of course, the legendary Ant McLernan. Oh. Come on, get in there! <laughs> Good morning, welcome to Downland. Slight change of plans this year. We've had a sale of the estate, great new owners, new investment, new people, new ideas, fantastic. We decided to go down the simulator game route. We don't want to do it as everybody else does simulator game. So what we've decided to do, change it up, make it exactly as it would be on a game day. So we're gonna do controlled flushes. We're gonna put in different angles of birds. We're gonna put in different traps. We've invested heavily to make it, hopefully, one of the best simulator game businesses out there. We've got our beautiful grade two listed barn that we meet in, we travel out in. We've got a new gun bus on the way. We've got lads employed. It's an exciting new time. We've got the best in the business here today to come and have a go. We'll see what they make of it. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Downland. Welcome to our first day, our demo day. And we're gonna take them out for a little cheeky high bird challenge at the end. Oh! <laughs> I'm hoping Mr. Carter's gonna take home that gilet that he's winning. If he doesn't, I'm disowning him. He's done. We'll see how we get on. We're gonna go out, do two drives. We're gonna go up some 11s at Log Cabin. The third drive after 11s is, then we're gonna shoot a high tower challenge, which I know some of you are looking forward to and some probably not. We'll do one final drive to finish the day off, come back here, sit down, have an evening meal. If a pigeon comes over, I will personally reward whoever gets a pigeon with a bottle of slow gin. But the biggest prize of all of it, I think with the caliber of the people in this room today is gonna to be bragging rights. So. Whoever does win the high bird challenge has got bragging rights. If it's not Johnny Carter, I'm leaving the YouTube channel. I'm having nothing to do with it. So if you can all come forward and draw a peg, please. And then, like I say, remember that number, move up two after each drive. Oi. Well, that's the one I wanted. Yeah, me too, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really excited for today. I know that I historically have not been ever excited by a sim day, but Ant and I have shot sim days together. We both have very similar feelings on them. We both know what we like and what we don't like. I know he's done a good job. I'm just kind of nervous and excited to see how that goes. Sharing a peg with Tim as well. That's gonna be unrelenting if I miss. And the competition later, that's a, an addition that I wasn't expecting. I've seen a video on Instagram of the target. He's big. The first drive was Quince's, a classic Hampshire Valley, topped with a big hedgerow. Are you excited? I'm always excited, Johnny. But you generally are very bubbly man. I'm a bubbly man, um, especially after a curry. <laughs> See, that's me bubbly. <laughs> <laughs> Miss. Oh, that's Miss. Dude, that's a Miss. kill. That's a kill. Johnny, let me give it I'm glad that you are here. <laughs> So what I like oh, about Johnny's stance, it's a bit like a, a German SS soldier <laughs> looking at the Nuremberg rally. It's very angular and upright. And, oh, he actually hit one. Oh, speed oh. You're shooting very well today, Tim. I know, it's you unusual, isn't it? I'll tell you what it is. Really? It's these whole cartridges. Oh, Johnny Carter, what a shot. Oh, Johnny Carter! That was a good shot. Oh, don't worry, I'll let... I'll oh, you should feel down for this, but it's 28 degrees today. So great, that is. Looks an awful like you're, uh, run out of cartridges there, Tim. Phil. Oh, yeah, come on, it's all you. Oh, yeah. Missed it. You don't have the etiquette of flight game. You're allowed to play. You should be playing. Chris, do you want some cards? I've got loads of Johnnies. They're free. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I mean, Ant said this morning it would be quieter than a normal sim day. Yeah. I mean, that didn't feel quiet. It, it, and we're sharing a peg. It's righteously hot. You can tell a gamekeeper set that Simo drive up because that was like proper pheasant flushes. That was a game shoot. You'd get twos and threes. Yeah. You'd get packs at 10. Yeah. You'd get one escaping out the side. That big looper was like when the pigeon comes over. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. And, and we're all there letting the flushes come through, waiting for the yeah, wait, 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 wait. The next drive was Broken Oaks. Instead of being in an open field, we were tucked into the trees where snap shooting would be the name of the game. And I decided to take an SL3 out for a play. It's like somewhere between 19 and 24 grand. Do you know what, that's the same price as a Dacia Duster. A yeah, brand I'd rather new, own that and cycle, Tim. A brand new Dacia Duster. And yet, I'll say it again, I'd rather own that shotgun. Mate, there's a lot of trees in front. This is gonna be a yoga moment. Yeah, we we're a one in. Oh, Broken just oats. missed the pigeon. Oh, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> the second drive, it's got started a little quickly. We've got a lake behind us, there's guns on the pontoons on the lake. I'm shooting out very quickly over the trees. <laughs> did you just say the gun shoots less than I did? Wait, wait, it, it doesn't have much cast to it. And That's I true. should yeah, have put yeah, like yeah. a... Um... Oh, I tell you what, mate, you've changed. You have just said it's annoying. I'm not shooting a custom gun. No, oh, that's custom that for is... you. Um, it's definitely quicker. This is not the place to try a new gun. I, I, I really like this gun. Go on, Tim. Go on, Johnny. Go on, Johnny. Go on, Johnny. Go on. Oh. Directly, but I mean, if that target was in a competition, people would complain. That is hard. People complain in competitions anyway. That is true. Mate, it just took a while, right? It's a lot faster. A, a than the long other. while. And so it, it took, I mean, it took 50 cartridges to hit a bird with any consistency. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to degrade it because it's a very reasonably priced gun. Oh, not a moment too soon. I think what's quite interesting there is changing between a 500 quid gun and a Dacia Duster priced gun seeing how different they are. They both work. Oh, the, yeah, the, the shotguns are a very simple tool, but I know which one I'd choose if you put them both on the table. I've shot this drive as a pheasant drive, and I would probably almost say it was better as a clay drive. Uh, as a pheasant drive, the birds are the same, but it's hard to get on them when you tuck this close into a tree. With the clays, that's what these days are all about, though, right? There's no pressure to go there and shoot every clay. If you're an avid, I mean, Tim there is, you want to keep your barrels hot, but I am definitely ready for 11s. <laughs> It needs to be said that Downlands is one of the most beautiful estates in Britain. Alongside its ancient woodlands and lake studded valley is this unbelievable log cabin where we would be having elevenses and some much needed refreshment. Ant and I have been on a number of sim days together and always felt something was missing. But so far, Ant was knocking this day out of the park. The mix of big loopers, clay flushes and mid-drive brakes was nothing short of mega. And of course, the food and drink was exceptional. What else did you expect? It was soon time to down drinks and pick up guns for one of my favourite drives in the world. The aptly named Pondfield. Why are we on the other side of a massive blooper? Oh, I can't see in the sun. I gave that too much. It's closer than that last looper. Is it? Oh, yeah. Two. Well, I did close it earlier. Oh, no! Are you ready for a big shot now? No, we're going to try for it, mate. Let's see how it goes. Are you ready? Sovereign oh. six and a half, baby. Oh. You know what? <laughs> he hasn't hit that yet. <laughs> I'm out of here. As a drive for pheasants, this is one of my favourite pheasant bikes in the world. And as a drive for clays, it's just as good. That vista up the hill is just... Right, we're allowed to rest for a minute, which is good, because right. I've got to pick the bits of clay out of my teeth where 
freaking long tall John over here decided to blow but one up above my head. What I'm doing is saving your life. Saving my life. They're about to land on your head. Looper! Oh, someone got it. Oh, Not like that though, baby. They found it. <laughs> Woo! Yes. No. Way too much. That's oh. changed. He's changed that. Right, so this is really good. So during the drive, he's changed all the clay traps. That's properly simulated, isn't it? Oh no! Come on, Johnny, come on, kill it, kill it, kill it! It's about your height now! Yeah! <laughs> You know, like on a simo day, you can shoot as much as you want. Yeah. That's bollocks. You shoot at everything. It's like, it's like doves in Argentina, isn't it? So you you can... just get into addicted to pulling yeah. the trigger. Go, go, like this, look. Oh, I, I mean, that was a perfect display one. of two amazing hits. Again. <laughs> Mate, the fact that those birds were constantly changing through the drive was quite fun. Like, we had everything from a 10 foot partridge to a I mean, I don't know. That wasn't representative of any bird other than maybe a crow hooking up 60, 70 yards. Yeah, and, and then coming back in. Back along with the wind. That was wild. But we had we had four different... You just got used to shooting. Like these ones These ones straight down the throat were dead easy. And you had to readjust and rethink what you were yeah, doing. They, so you they twisted the looper. They twisted all the traps. That yeah, became... Yeah, it was great. You weren't just mechanically shooting. You were actually shooting like on a mm. pheasant shoot where you got to think about how you're shooting and where they're flying. That, was, that was really good. Definitely the longest drive out of the three, but yes. it felt like the shortest. It almost pains me to say, but that sim drive was almost as good as standing the peg for the real thing. Now it's time for the high bird challenge. I'm glad you are enjoying yourself. <laughs> what is that? That's, that is his load of heat. Is that like from under the stairs? <laughs> Ant had been bigging this up to me, and it's safe to say I was pretty nervous. He's got the finest ammunition on the market. He's got the finest gun on the market. He's seen me shoot it. What more does he need? He's got the finest eyewear on the market. I like this man. Especially seeing as the Longthorn was back in the truck. James is going to shoot first. I'm going to shoot second. We're then going to work it through as number one, which is Mr. Weston. Number two, three, four to nine. We've really got 10 good. targets. It's who shoots the best out of 10 targets. And it's a big one. So, James. <laughs> nine nil. 32 gram 5 hydro one is, I reckon. It saved them for like halfway through. Just shorten it, I reckon. Give it a touch more yank. Hey! There's one. Hey! Two out of ten. <laughs> well done, Mr. Weston. I think that Johnny offered to help load for me so he could see where I put the gun, so he could learn from me, like he always does, piggybacks on me, you know. He's got all the gear, and if he doesn't straighten it, he's got no idea. No, that's it. Ooh. You, mate. <laughs> In a nice way. One nil. Just in case you didn't know, mate, it's one nil. Two nil. Got the priority, Lloyd. Oh, don't start with this game. Come on, <laughs> get in there. He's used all his talent. <laughs> Thank you. You've got to get all of these now, Johnny, to beat. Oh, Ooh. five nil. Hey! 10-1, Johnny Carter. Who's Ooh. number two? Turns out that target needed nowhere near the lead I was giving it, but I obviously realized this too late. Oh! <laughs> Chris with a three. Well shot, Chris. Well done, mate. The witty P, however, was on form and smashed the majority of these monster targets. I feel like I've already won, to be honest. At this point, I'm just happy. Oh, eight four! Oh. Eight four! Lloydy B! Come on, Lloyd! He'll save us going into a shoot off. Oh. Hey. Nine five! Oh. Oh. Well done, Mr. Person. Six killed. Looks like Ant will be disowning TGS after all. I really love this addition to the day. The whoops and hollers when people got a break created some unforgettable moments with the team. Before it was time for the final drive. This was once again tucked into the trees for some fast action. This drive is Pond Return. That was up there with humiliating moments of my life. I went in and watched everyone else shoot it. I gave it twice as much lead as it needed, but it looked really big. But we, we can talk about that, because I had 10 shots and I hit two. You had 10 shots and you hit one. <laughs> Sasha had one shot and, and hit he hit one. one. 
right? And then he did it, the big I am. Yeah, the old, um, the old, I do that Crack the cartridge over his shoulder. Over his shoulder, I do that all the time. Oh, he I'm is an amazingly that. talented shooter for a man who doesn't shoot. You and know, he walks like that all the time, yeah, yeah, win no, or no. He, did. he got very media art on all of us. He's quite good. Um, and he, he's, so the reason the sound's not great is because he's now standing 40 feet away from everybody because that's what he's demanding. Well, that's the problem, that's the size yeah. of his head. No, but it hurts that's... to get beaten by Lloyd, but if nobody else, everyone else can beat me. Got faster than that, Tim. Get in the sunshine. Be there quick. Yeah, I've got it. The beauty of the tree is that even if you miss the target, it kind of feels good anyway. So that's nice. It has taken a few drives to get used to this. I probably should have just shot it position, but it didn't feel like the gun to shoot that big target with. In hindsight. Yeah, sometimes when you're paying attention or talking to the camera, absolutely smoke them. Oh, I'm loving life, but my little bead's falling out my gun, so I'm probably not going to shoot oh, very straight now. Reloading you're break. Take your reloading break if you've got any more ammo. Wake up early than that, Tim. Come on. Tim has completely lost his. And I seem to have found some love with this gun. I'm just shooting through Apparently the tree. the game is to shoot the clay at the moment it passes the tree to drop some tree on Tim. Please stop. <laughs> Having an amazing day. This place means a lot to me. It is an unbelievably beautiful part of the world. Good shot, John. Good shot, well done. Well, through the tree, you want it? You can't have everything. Yeah, no. No, but I was pretending you'd hit it for the camera. Oh, okay. So, yes, 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 yes. Oh. Mate, that's for last. That was an unbelievably enjoyable day. Like, you know when you eat a really hot curry? You probably shouldn't enjoy it because you know it's going to ruin you in the morning. But the enjoyment that you had for eating the hot clay type yeah. curry, which is probably the worst metaphor I could have come I up mean, with, this, but I'm in the middle of it now. This is a stretch, <laughs> even by my comparison. Yeah, no, this yeah, is, yeah. but we're going to go with it because You're stuck in I'm it stuck yeah, now. Yeah, you've started, you're committed. So, so, it's the, so the day was so enjoyable, you're definitely going to have to ring your wife on the way home to ask to put the toilet paper in the fridge, aren't you? <laughs> what a fantastic day. I knew Ant would put on a day to remember, and I was not wrong. When I shot the competition, I dropped a few, yeah, but then when the competition had finished and I went back in, I straight in just about. Yeah. Yeah. That's because oh, I didn't want to win my own competition. <laughs> oh, I gave you it. You were right. letting, you were letting you. me have it. I get it, I get I'm it. I understand. That is so nice. Of Handout of the Down Lungevo. Here we go. And the whole cartridge. Uh, see you guys. Yeah. 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 If you could just sit back down, please, Mike. Uh, it was Sasha, actually. Sasha wins it. <laughs> <laughs> Sasha only oh. shot one target and hit it. So he's 100% strike rate. So oh. there we go. Yeah. Thank you very much. Well done, Sasha. Oh. Oh. In all seriousness, Lloyd B, what a legend, mate. Six out of ten, well done, mate. Thank you very much. That And I think, as far as stepping away from TGS goes, I think Johnny, unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sin Sin enjoyed Lloyd yeah. 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 Sin as though you only did one more than Andy Brady, which is one. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to have to step away, mate, and have some space if that's okay. We've had a break anyway. We've had a bit of a break. Nobody will notice. Nobody will notice. <laughs> The drives were carbon copies of the real thing I have come to love so much. The big wildcard targets in the drive were a welcome distraction from the driven birds. The hospitality was next level, and regardless of how that competition went, it was one of my highlights of the day. But honestly, any day spent at Downlands is time well spent. So, end of the first day, mate, what do you think? Well done, mate. Thank you very much. That was a lot of fun. Yeah? I expected nothing less, of course. That was a lot of fun. I loved the competition. I lost by a considerable margin to you. <laughs> I still enjoyed it. Ergo, it must have been fun. Yeah, but you're getting used to that now. Losing Am to I? me by a considerable margin. Isn't that why we stopped the clay tour? Yeah, because I was beating you too much. And yeah, you just got a little yeah, bit upset yeah. about it. The, 
you shrink told you not to do it anymore, so we just yeah, it's packed it in a bit. It's, we should bring it back now, you're feeling better. Yeah, perfect. It's going to bring back my drinking problem. <laughs> Mike, but genuinely fantastic. It was nice to see, actually, the guns that really stand out in amongst the line, the ones that would challenge themselves and go for those harder targets. And you get certain people that obviously, you watch them shooting in the line, they're happy to shoot the more simplistic driven stuff. And then you get your boys that you can see them hunting that big target and actually wanting it. And that's why I wanted to put them sort of targets in for those boys that want to stretch and challenge a little bit and go, I'm going to kill that. And then I'm going to kill it there and there and there. You know. And then when they crank, it must be the flow mask, they crank that right back and suddenly oh, we yeah. get these monster loopers even behind. It. it was all kinds of fun. All yeah. kind of shooting. Yeah. Just dumb. And there was still easier stuff coming out if you just wanted to get your eye back in. But mate, epic yeah. day. Are you happy? I'm very happy, mate. Yeah, I'm good to have it behind me. You know, I've got a lot of things I want to change moving forward. We've got a lot of drives that we need to develop. We've got to open up new bits of ground, new drives for wind direction, for people's abilities, for yeah. things people want. What I want to be able to do is do a bespoke thing where we can have a conversation with whoever's booking the day beforehand to say, what do you want to do? You know, are you practicing to go out on grouse? Are you practicing to go out on partridge? Are you going out on ducks? Are you going out on pheasants? Are you wanting to do a mix of any of those? You know, and we can cater the day to create the drives to be exactly what they want to do. A big thank you to the whole Downlands team in creating these memories. And I look forward to coming back and making many more. Thanks for watching guys. We'll see you next time. Thank you for watching guys. This channel is made possible by our amazing sponsors. You can find out more about them in the description down below. And if you want to support the channel, you can join as a member. You get loads of extra content, well, some extra content, and occasionally we hook up and go clay shooting together as a membership group. If you don't feel like joining today, we really appreciate you watching and subscribing. Have a wonderful day.